I'm back. I was just looking at some of the stuff I had posted and who liked it. And I was in just a minute ago I was telling y'all how rodeo is a family and I was looking at who liked my stuff and Aaron Bean from Northern California, I believe Willits liked something and I thought of Aaron we're old friends, been knowing each other a long time. And I thought of Aaron and uh we used to go to them Northern California uh, CCA rodeos together or at the same time. And my most memorable moment with Aaron is um, I was sitting on my bull in Covalo, California, and I believe Aaron was pulling my rope. And then uh, this old Jess Gorley rope, I love Jess Gorley ropes, uh, it snapped. Because uh, I would adjust my loop every time for the size of the bull. And it turned out that that rope was pulling and getting tension every time in that same spot. And over the years, I want to say this w rope had probably been on 500 bulls when it snapped. And uh, so what do you do? I just sat there on my bull, Aaron, he, I don't even think we said nothing. Aaron just reached behind him. It was a small walkway, so he was able to stand on the chute like he was. And he just reached behind him and grabbed his right-handed rope. And I never got off this bull. We just hung his rope on. And I rode left-handed, but it was a right-handed rope, and that's whatever. I was entered. That's all I had to do. So I went out there, <clears throat> and this little bull I got on, he bucked a little bit, and he started turning back one way or another. I can't remember, but um, I was hung up. I was still on him. I was riding him, but I was, like, I couldn't come off of him. My hand was stuck. Like, it, it, it had to work out like it was. I was able to ride this bull, praise the Lord, and... Uh, then able to get out of there somehow. But I remember the sensation of my hand not being, it was stuck. So it was a good thing that that bull got rode and I was all right getting out of there. Wound up uh, winning that little deal and the, they, they gave me a buckle. And I gave that buckle to my little nephew Jackson, my sister Sarah's son. And I really hope he still has it, Sarah. Because um, your times are tough. I might have to get it back and pawn it. So, uh, Thank you, Aaron. I told him then. I'll tell him again because I've got social media now and I can blast it. Thank you, Aaron Bean, for the use of your bull rope. It worked out well for me. Thank you, sir. Um, I just thought of maybe I should have paid you for it. But I appreciate the favor. And we'll just, we won't worry about the money. Thank you. All right, then.